Hi, welcome to this step-by-step -step tutorial on how to install and start the TigerGraph Community Edition using Docker. Whether you're a data enthusiast, a developer, or just curious about graph databases, this guide will help you get TigerGraph up and running in no time. Let's dive in. Before we begin, make sure you have the following prerequisites. If you don't have Docker yet, head over to docker.com to download and install it. Once you've got these ready, let's move on to the next step. Open your web browser and go to dl.tigergraph.com. Navigate to the TigerGraph community section and select the Docker image for the latest version. Complete the required information to request a download link. You will receive an email containing the link, which will be valid for two hours. Once the download is complete, you'll have a .tar.gz file. Alternatively, you can use wget to download the image. Run docker load-i to load the Docker image into your local Docker environment. To verify the image is loaded, you can run Docker Images. You should see TigerGraph slash community listed in the output. Run the command in your terminal to start a TigerGraph container using the image you just loaded. The dash D flag runs the container in detached mode. The dash dash name flag gives your container a name, in this case, my TigerGraph. The dash P flags map the container's ports to your local machine. Once the container starts, TigerGraph will be up and running. Run the command docker execute to access the container's bash shell to interact with TigerGraph. Inside the container, start the TigerGraph services by running gadmin start all. This command initializes all TigerGraph services. It might take a few moments to complete. Once done, you can confirm all services are up and running by running gadmin status. Now that TigerGraph is running, let's access the web-based interface for managing your graph database. Open your web browser and go to localhost on port 14240. You'll see the TigerGraph login page. Use the default credentials TigerGraph TigerGraph to log in. And there you go, you're now ready to explore TigerGraph and start building your graph databases. To quickly get started, you can find a detailed tutorial readme file at the link in the description. You can use GSQL Shell to run those GSQL queries. Alternatively, you can use Graph Studio to start designing your first graph. To maximize your experience with TigerGraph, I encourage you to explore other available tutorials. Thank you.